Hey guys, what's up? It is Boo. My actual name is Ashley. We are spending the whole day fishing. Definitely prepared a lot better today for the cold. Um, I do have my new ice fishing gear from Stryker. Uh, I have the Prism Ladies I swear, I've been needing new bibs for a very long time and I actually have a really nice coat. I'll show you guys what they look like and everything. Just got back from the gas station. Had to get some of the essentials, like a big old water and some Lunchables. Um, we're gonna go target some catfish today, some kitties. Um, right now, he is out catching some bait, some bluegills. And yeah, I'm super like pumped up. So let's do this thing. <laughs> In my new coat. It's my favorite color. Got about like three layers on. No shame. Got little buttons at the bottom kind of fasten them so they don't fly open. Coat is super comfortable. So many different layers and pockets. Big pockets too. Got the zipper and the little magnets to keep it all together. Hood. If it gets really cold. Shout out to Mark for the Timmy license plate. Now she's complete. Or he or whatever you want to call it. Well, we can slave it away over here when Jordan pulled through Clark. You catch one or you catch a bluegill? The bluegill. Way over there. It looks better today it at least. It is, like all that snow is gone, but the last hole I drilled is that half layer of water and then an inch of ice. Ugh. And then my dog jacket went off, like he watched it go off. It was pretty it sweet. It went like this, didn't even move. And then it just went. And, and then I couldn't get it out of the pole holder, and by the time I did, I was went to go fight it. So. And they still won't hit a creek chub or a minnow. <laughs> yeah, they don't do that. Jordan did pretty good on uh, minnows one year, but yeah, I didn't believe him. I think Bob. he was lying. <laughs> minnow bodies and minnow heads. <laughs> I know, but these ones, these ones here definitely prefer bluegill. Yeah. I'm gonna have to remember that. A nice learning experience for the ice cats. Like, maybe native food makes a big, big difference through the ice. I don't know if it makes a big difference, but for me, it's a confidence. Well, they were thing too. staring at it. They were staring at the bluegills too. Yep. The only ones that got hit were bluegills. Yeah. Yeah. But was it the bait or was it the baiter? I don't even know what you just said. <laughs> <laughs> How do I answer that? that? <laughs> Well, I suppose I should probably get pan optics down. Let's see what so we got. Tell you boys, where they're at. I've been saying that to Jordan all year. He like gets excited. He's like, I got one coming. I'm like, Jordan, guess what? You ain't got shit. <laughs> <laughs> the struggle. Hey, there's none of that sketchy slushy stuff though. It still is though. I'll try to catch some more bait. <sighs> oh yeah, got one on me. Big one? No. <laughs> Probably a bluegill. Oh uh, yeah, there's a couple, there's three under me. Nice. You should try catching them, Josh. I'm gonna try, but it might just be that time of day that they're gonna just look at us. But we'll be here long enough that they'll turn on eventually, right? I had a bluegill on me. It's pretty exciting. Did you? Yeah. Nice. We need those. I have a chunk of bluegill on. Catch a bluegill on a chunk of bluegill? Savage. Be the world's meanest bluegill. And ironically, I have bluegill six feet under the ice. I swear every time Hello, we get. Jacker. Oh, oh. Oh, oh my goodness. I see him fighting on the pan optics. Oh, nice. No. Dang it. My drag wasn't tight. 
Just too loose? Yeah. That was so cool. I saw him. Talk about your all time <laughs> screw ups. Was it a big one? I don't know. It didn't look bad. It was definitely Spencer's PB. <laughs> he was almost to the hole when he came off. Yeah, he came up pretty fast. Why do I suck today? Is that two you missed? No, just one. Oh, yeah. Jordan did the other one. Let's see if I can find something better for you to look at. There's a bunch. Ooh. Fiery guy right there. That's like 10 guys. I don't know which direction it is, but I need to drill a hole there. That would be that way. That way? <coughs> Got something on me. Say a prayer. Prayer. Thanks. Come on. Boo needs to catch a fish. I just got bumped. On the tungsten? Yep. Was it riveted? Totally. Exciting. Not really. It's time. You want some knockoff Lunchables? Uh, not quite yet. I'll give you my Butterfinger. Oh, thanks. <laughs> I appreciate it, though. Yeah. It's talent tying on anything with these stupid nails. Dang nails. They're purdy, though. He's coming to me now. No, he's still under me, Sam. No. You got one of the other seven that were over here. He just like nudged it. Like so pathetically. <laughs> like he just licked it? Yeah. If that. <laughs> he's like, ugh. He it a little harder. Are we still getting Mexican food tonight? I have no idea. Depends what time we get out of here, I suppose. But yeah, I mean, if everyone's down for Mexican food, I'm down. You already thinking about dinner? <laughs> welcome to welcome to Boo. Boo likes her food. I'm always planning my meals. Planning <laughs> meals. You gotta make sure you eat. Yep. I can relate. So I'm marking quite a few catfish. This is about 16 feet. The catfish. I'm like, we've been marking a ton, but they're just not biting. Oh, there's a couple right there. I don't know how well you can see that, but there's some pretty, pretty good marks. They usually hit the best towards the evening, like right as the sun's going down, but during the day is just hit and miss. I haven't caught anything today. Seems like a lot of people are leaving. They can't hang. The guys left. They're all the way over on the main lake. I gotta watch the jaw jackers. Hopefully one of them goes off, but it ain't looking too good. Oh, oh my god. <gasps> Sorry for the bad words. So sorry. There's literally so many underneath me. Whenever they're just sitting on top of me like that, um, I watch my rod tip. And if it goes even slightly down, you just gotta rip it. Right above me. Oh my goodness. Oh, shoot. I almost had a That's a big one. Oh my goodness. Goodness, oh my goodness. These are kitties too. Guaranteed. I don't know if you can see the screen, but that is just blowing up with fish. Yeah, I just missed like two of them. Really? Yeah. 
Seriously? <laughs> like, we hooked into them and got them like halfway up and they came off. Ugh, that's so sad. <laughs> really? Where Josh is at is probably the farthest we'll go. But he's on like a massive fish pile and there's so many packages. So many. They're just more active because it's like 20, 21 feet. Mm hmm. That is crazy. Yeah. I'll stay over here. <laughs> I'm gonna shut off for no reason in the middle of that. Man, I didn't get the hooks up, but we've been struggling. That's a nice one. Yeah, he ain't bad. He ate the shit out of it, though. <laughs> Gonna roll right out. Yay! He has it down. Want me to get the big camera? No, it's almost dead. Okay. He's smaller than the last one. How did that feel, Josh? Oh, pretty good. I swear you like sabotage me anytime I come over here. <laughs> Forget how to catch fish. <laughs> Just gotta find the dumb ones, I guess. He uh, didn't hesitate at all. He was just there and he glitched it? Pretty much. He like turned around on it once and then... Sounds awesome. Came Sounds back like for fun. The, <laughs> for the whole package, Spencer. <laughs> Not dialed, but... Good job. Catching. Thanks. Thanks, man. You're welcome. I wish I could be like you. <laughs> Oh man. That was a wonderful sound. You Haven't guys... heard that in a while. <laughs> well, he ain't up here yet. I'm gonna grab him. That would be sweet. He's here. We were just talking about how sad the fishing is. Oh, Come that's on, bud. pretty dang nice. I don't want to grab the line. We'll just let them wear out for a sec so you don't need a hook in the face. I'm so excited. Me too. <laughs> oh. 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 Well, what's wrong with his butt? <laughs> <That's>, <laughs> looks like he's been eating painful things. The other one was like that too. I'm honestly, I don't know, this is like twice as big as any catfish I've ever caught through the ice and it's kind of embarrassing to say that, but I'm going to be honest with you. And uh, pretty stoked. <laughs> Anything to add? Like, oh, um, I mean, I'm jealous, but I'll take a picture. That'd be sweet. The good lighting in the background and everything. Perfect. Sweet. I'm gonna let him go because, well, I think you have to on this lake, but I would anyway because this is a freaking nice channel cap. <laughs> He's just like, what happened? You know, I've said this a million times, but when that jaw jacker goes off and sets the hook in one of these fish's face, it has to just turn their world upside down. <laughs> What's that Will Ferrell movie where he gets like thrown up into the ceiling? You know what I'm talking about? Where he's like sitting in his little cubicle space? <laughs> mm, yeah. I can't think of the movie though. Oh, there he goes. See ya. Nice. Thanks. Good job. Fish slime high five. <laughs> <laughs> Might be the grossest high five of your life. <laughs> <laughs> no, there's been much worse. <laughs> Alrighty, so that kind of wraps up uh, the end of that video. Spencer ended up catching one. Josh caught a couple. Um, I caught nothing. Hurts my heart. I know, but it was still a fun time. Uh, shout out to Jordan. He will be linked down below. Good Life Outdoorsman. And Spencer, River Certified. Of course, Josh, um, Pig Patrol TV. Appreciate all the support. We'll be making more videos in the future. 
I am shooting for, you know, one video a week. I do run a business, so, you know, it's kind of just whenever we get the chance to go out and edit and that kind of thing. But I really enjoy editing. I really enjoy making videos. I think it's a lot of fun and we'll have a lot of fun times to come up. So yeah, thanks for watching.